Hey there, Gemini. What's up? What's good? What's happening? Welcome in. Welcome back. Wow, you can tell I was just rubbing my nose. <laughs> this is going to be a general message for Gemini, the cross watcher, or anybody else that was drawn here. Take what fits, leave what doesn't. If none of this hits home, just try a different message. If you have a series of readings that aren't hitting home, take a little break. I'm going to start with the lesson cards. Just get a couple overall energies for Gemini. Regret. Mm, someone feels remorse for the way they treated you. <sighs> Decision. It's time to decide about this relationship. Interference. So somebody regrets making the decision to bring a third party into the situation. You don't have to be a tarot reader to make sense of that. Um, goodness. Just straight to the point, huh, Gemini? All right, all right. Maybe this has been an ongoing thing for you, so it's easy to just jump right into it. Or maybe it's like the only thing that's really got your focus. So it's like, we need to talk about this right now. Either way, I hear you. I feel you. Let's do this. This is the Naked Heart Tarot. I'm just going to do a free-for-all. Let them come out how they come out. For Gemini here. I'm also hearing, I regret going behind your back. Um, there's something about like stealing money or spending money without your knowledge. It's almost like they have, I don't know, movement of cups. Oh, I bet there's a movement. All right. Mm -hmm. Here comes that fucking apology. Sorry. Sorry. I can feel your energy. You are not in the mood. <laughs> <clears throat> For Gemini, poor thing. Tell me about this apology. There's like really this, I don't give a hoot and a holler what they have to say, what kind of sorry ass excuse they have. <laughs> Your words, not mine. Page of cups, a page is a page, a night is a night. Either way, neither of them are a king. What does Gemini want to talk about then? Okay. Okay. Emperor in reverse. Nine of Pentacles in reverse. If you're really going through it and you're having a hard time, I implore you to listen to the song you don't own me i'm not just one of your many toys you don't own me don't say i can't go with other boys someone has lost their honestly i'm gonna call it what it is grip control over you they don't own you they can't control you that's why they're sorry. And you know that. You didn't need me to tell you. You didn't need the cards to tell you. You know this. I am super proud of you because I can tell that you really stuck around this person more than they deserved to be in your presence. You gave them more chances than they deserved. You gave them more love, more time, more energy, more everything than they deserved. They did not deserve you. They were feeding off of you, your money, your safe place, the food that you cook, the conversations, the free alcohol, whatever the fuck it was. They were freeloading off of you in some way, somehow. Okay. And now they're cut off. They were guilting you somehow. Maybe they were paying for your stuff. But then they turn around and use that against you. Oh, you're too good for me now? After I went and did this, that, and the other? But here's the thing. You also did shit for them. So why are they going to discount that? Like, oh, so I've never done anything for you? Like, it's narcissistic.
you are no longer their supply. Therapy, some good friends, and a bottle of wine might do you wonders. And I promise you, put that song on, even if it's just in the background, it's going to help. It's going to help. My God, that great is just living its best life. Four of Wands. I don't give a fuck if this was your twin flame. They don't deserve you. Maybe in the next life. Now the big sis in me is going to come out like super protective over you. <laughs> I don't approve of them, honey. You can do everything better than that. This person is not... They're not even worth your tears. They're not worth your rage. They're not worth your wrath. They're not worth your any of it. And if they were supporting you somehow, just to hold, her, hold it over your head as in leverage, right? You don't need it. God is good. God is great. And he will, through him, you will find a way. Another way. It doesn't have to come through this person. If that's the source, that's why the nightmare came to be. Because that was the source. So they were either holding stuff over your head, leverage, right? Or they were just taking, taking, taking. And the most they did to give back was say thank you. Sometimes they didn't even do that. Somebody regrets that they, you know, it's crazy to me. How, make it make fucking sense. They regret not having you around, but the reason you're not around is because when you were, they treated you like shit. Make it make sense. Did they think that you were never going to just walk away, even if it caused a struggle, even if, you know, did they really think you wouldn't eventually find a safe haven? Or make other arrangements? Like, you can't push somebody and push and push and push and push and push and then get mad when they stop coming around because they're sick of being pushed around. It's your actions that led them to stop showing up. So this could be somebody that just does not take accountability. Maybe they just, the ego. I almost wonder, because like, you hear a lot of that with parents nowadays, you know? They don't take accountability for what they did. Like, if you would just admit that you weren't the perfect parent, you made some mistakes and apologize for it, we could start moving past it. But no, you can't even do that. What the fuck kind of parent are you? That sounds really conditional to me. That's not love. That's not a parent. At least not a good one. Gemini, I don't know who's been trying to sell you short here but kick him in the balls on your way out i'm sorry my shadow <laughs> three of swords this is why i'm so like i'm sorry this is why you're so um just irritated with the situation it's so irritating this person was a nightmare they ripped your heart out of your chest you gave them your heart and they trashed it. Movement of pentacles. And when the pieces hit the floor, you just let them stay there for a minute. You didn't even pick it up right away. You just I need a minute. <laughs> I will give you props, though, Gemini. I can tell you're the kind of person that, as angry as you are, you didn't lash out on anybody. You didn't project that out into the world. You're not giving this person what they want, which is to continue to upset you, to continue to get a reaction out of you. That's how they get your energy, is that reactive energy, and they love it. They feed off of it. They foam at the fucking mouth for it, and you're just not giving it to them. I'm so proud of you. I am so proud of you. Please recognize that is not easy. I recognize that you had to have gone through a lot to be able to master that. I'm so proud of you. My whole team is. Your whole team is. Our teams are super proud of you. Your roots go deep, by the way. The 
naked heart, the sun, the ten of pentacles, the star. Look at all this positivity. Yeah, they were absolutely a narcissist. I knew that. I knew that. Look at there's the five of cups was the second one to try and come out. They can have that because it's not yours. You didn't ask for that. You didn't deserve that. So we're going to give that to them. Keep your fucking energy. We don't want it. And stay the fuck away from ours. Sorry about all the cuss words. This is a very highly emotional type of situation. And if you got to say a couple of bad words in the privacy of your own home as you're venting and then cleanse, <laughs> then do so. If that's what keeps you from losing your cool on somebody, okay. Just make sure you cleanse the space afterwards. <laughs> but yeah, you're a real one. You're a real one. There's a reason that they wanted your energy because you got that good energy. You come from the tree of life. You have angelic. You have a touch of... You're pure. You don't get riled up unless it's justified. You know what I mean? But you've even learned how to contain, control that. I'm going to leave it right here. I hope this helps to it needs to how it needs to. I love you, and I'll see you in the next one. Until then, stay beautiful.